can't believe he invented a thing that exploded uselessly. <laughs> Listen, if, is that not the essence of mad science? Yeah, but your scientists were so preoccupied with whether or not they could, they didn't stop to think if they should. Hello everyone, I'm Dean. Uh, That's Donnie. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, my, my partner's been zombified right now. No. <laughs> I just wanted to point this out. We were looking at the, 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 the settings here. Yep. We could have been in 16.9, but look at that. Oh, oh it's stretched out. I don't like it. We got, what the hell is Pixel Perfect? Pixel Perfect is... Uh, it's not 4.3. <laughs> I think it's, it just makes it look... Uh, oh. Yeah, 16.9 with scan lines. Okay. Oh, no, oh, no, I don't, no I don't like any of this. Just, just keep coming over here. It's fine. It's okay. fine. It's cool. <laughs> it's fine. Ready? <laughs> uh, you feel better after that, just a little bit? No, I'm still oh. tired. Oh. I want to go to sleep. <laughs> it's probably important, yeah. Sleep's always good. We got some Contra. Like, whose idea was this, dude? I don't know. This is good for no one. <laughs> it's not. I'm gonna be a fucking bab a dab da da doing mess. The whole the whole time. Gameplay through the floor. And it wasn't gonna be very good to start with because this is my first time playing a Contra game. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Rephrase that. First time playing this Contra game. Right. Okay. Cause I've played I've played Contra before. Yeah. But it's important to note that the first time you enter a Contra game, mm -hmm. you it's, it's hard cuz you don't know what the fuck to expect. <laughs> no. You don't. I'm I'm sorry for dragging along, but I, I thank works. you I thank you I thank you for taking this Contra bullet. Okay. Okay. Anyways, Neumann Told us who's in charge. I mean, we we kind of we kind of had a fucking deal here, Dean, yeah. where it's like, I take this bullet and then you take the next one. That's you know? fine. It's, yeah, it's, no, I, I yeah. agreed. So it's all good. Carl Bahamut. I believe you've heard of him. Uh, I mean, I've heard of Colonel T. Met. <laughs> Stop that. <laughs> He, he was a hero that fought during the alien wars, but two years ago he planned a coup d'etat to overthrow the government. I think you mean coup de tat. Would you like some horse d'oeuvres while you're at it? <laughs> the coup d'etat stopped and was stopped in time, but the colonel fled. The colonel. <laughs> and he, he fled from the corpse. Yeah. 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 <laughs> the hard corpse. <laughs> Until now, we've heard, we've had heard nothing of him. He's a dangerous man. I wonder what he's planning to do with that alien cell. His hideout is deep in the jungle. Good hunting. I think you mean jungle. <laughs> oh god. Right. Uh, oh fuck. Just keep shooting. <laughs> oh god. I. That was that was unfortunate. <laughs> my my brain says that fucking square should be shoot and X should be fucking jump. Right. I should have probably customized the controls coming in, but yeah. I don't like to do it. Why not? This is gonna sound real fucking stupid, but like for most things, I don't feel like it ever matters, you know? Really? Yeah. Like, uh... It, it depends. Like, when you... When you approach a game for the first time, right? Mm-hmm. What am I looking at? I... Alien. <laughs> it's a fucking alien, and its weak spot are is you, the bald spot on its head. Are you, are you on a spine? I, I'm on a bridge. Made of human spine? I... maybe. 
<laughs> I gotta tell you what it is. <laughs> you don't seem to be struggling very much. Well, the thing is that there's like a little glitch here and that that little piece of bridge doesn't move at all. So I just get to s sit right here and kill it dead. <laughs> Yay, <Okay>. exploits. <laughs> Fucking speedrun strat. Here. <laughs> Except that took forever. It, it did. No. <laughs> no, real, real speedrun strats would be like, no, this is how you do it in like seconds. But yeah. no, I'm just, this is lazy strats. Is that a fucking dinosaur of some kind? That's a dinosaur of some kind, yes. What was I saying? Uh, controls don't matter, just like the points. Yeah, most of the time that you like learn a game for the first time, right? Yeah. Like, I feel like, uh, to an extent, you have, I, I, or at least for me, right? What the fuck? If you shoot that, and then you jump into it, you die. That's just a fucking screw you that's built into the game. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Why does the dinosaur blow friggin... Laser nostrils? Yeah. I, I couldn't tell you. Why does it have laser snot? <laughs> I don't know. That's just the thing it has. Okay. What was I saying? Uh, it doesn't matter. The controls Fuck, don't matter. Why is it 3 a.m.? <laughs> next episode's gonna be like 4 a.m. <laughs> the next I episode's mean, gonna be like 5 a.m. <laughs> it's like time moves forward. <laughs> yeah, but not that fast. <laughs> Each episode is not an hour. <laughs> no, it's half an hour, and uh, we take small breaks in between. Uh, Anyways, Which means the last one started at fucking, you know, 2 a.m., right? Yeah. Which means, of course... Wow. Is that uh, really how you have to get past this? Yes. If you try and jump him, he will kill you, because you don't have the clearance to jump over him. Not even his double jump man? I, I think you could do it as double jump man, but the fact his arms are flailing around makes it kind of scary. Okay. <laughs> Point is, time moves forward, Dean. Yes. I, I learned that from uh, the Discovery Channel. Time's arrow marches forward. <laughs> also, those flowers. Uh, that's the only place you see them in this stage. Oh, okay. <laughs> they, they built an enemy specifically for this one part of the stage because, yes. Were we talking about time? <laughs> we were talking about time. Yes. But uh, what were we talking about besides time? So we meet again! Oh man, it's Deadshot. It's Dead Eye Joe! Oh, right. This place will be your graveyard. Wow, a whole yard for us? <laughs> <laughs> and he's got a transforming robot. I guess if you were playing as multiple people, it might be a graveyard rather than just a grave. But you could have just said grave. <laughs> so sad. What was I saying? What were you saying? Controls. Controls. I don't know. What I'm. What, uh, the point is, a lot of the time I can kind of just adapt, right? Yeah. I'm learning something for the first time, anyways. So like, my preference to controls don't matter. Yeah. Right. There are obviously exceptions, like if you're uh, used to fucking inverted camera controls versus not. I couldn't do inverts. In inverts bother the hell out of me. You're not like, supposed to be shooting this man. No, I can't do damage to him. If I shoot him, he does this. That's bad. Oh, <laughs> that is bad. <laughs> I mean, I could shoot him a bit more to... There we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I'm finding that uh, for some reason I have expectations of how this game should control and I'm not sure why. Right. Is, is, is it... <laughs> no, I'm not going to make that joke. <laughs> I was going to say, is it subverting your expectations? <laughs> There, I made the joke. <laughs> uh, it's, not, it's not much of a joke. No, it's not. Oh. Why is it 3 a.m.? I don't know. 
fuck. O other than time moving forward, I don't know. <laughs> I was also gonna say, is time moving forward for you at one second per second? What? <laughs> you got a lot of non-jokes right now, Dean. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not, like, I'm not sure what you're going for. Controls. <laughs> Let, let's continue with I that. I mean, I, I think we were done with that is the thing. Okay, alright, fine, sure. That's, that's the, the whole fucking point, is like, usually I can kind of adapt, especially if, like, you know, I've never played a game before. Because I have no expectations, right? Right. Uh, but here I do. Right. I guess there are also things like, uh, you know, what your movement keys are on, like, a keyboard. Mm-hmm. Like, for instance, for some reason, I grew up instead of the WASD, right? Uh-huh. I had the FASD. Really? Yeah, and that was, like, because the fucking guy whose, uh, house I would play PC games at, right? Mm -hmm. I would go and play Quake at. Oh, he he insisted on you know customizing his controls that way. Yeah. So I had to get used to that. That wow, that's unfortunate. Oh, sorry. Yeah. But then you know what happened? You got used to it. One day I was like, you know what? What if I just didn't do that and I just got used to WASD? <laughs> yeah. And then that happened. Good job. It didn't take a lot of effort. <laughs> This is the end for you! Damn! Also, damn, in a Genesis game. That's hardcore, Donnie. Is it? Yes. I can't believe we were betrayed by Dr. Baldy. <laughs> Just as we planned, Colonel. Doctor, what's going on? Just as you can see, the doctor's been assisting us. <laughs> Why was that in... Quotes. I don't know. <laughs> like, <laughs> he's been. What's, what's, what's that? The, a, what's what, the implication? <laughs> yeah, like, is that a euphemism? <laughs> the doctor has been betrayed. No, that doesn't even make sense. The doctor has been ass assisting <laughs> us. I am sick and tired of this weakening government. With his ass? <laughs> With his ass. Having obtained some magnificent of the alien cell, they squander the opportunity by locking it away in a vault. The Colonel feels as I do and will help me achieve my plans. Now I can carry on with my own dark experiments. <laughs> He's evil. May like, like, maybe it doesn't sound so good when you call them dark experiments. <laughs> right? Like, okay, if you wanna, if you want to, like, you know, experiment on the alien cell and try to use it to. I don't know. Advanced science. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> that's that's all well and good as a motivation, but when you start calling it a dark experiment, I feel like you have certain expectations <laughs> that uh, what you're doing is fucking wrong. <laughs> Why, you treacherous little... Well, Doctor, I will leave the rest up to you. There is no way to escape. You must surrender peacefully. Uh, yeah, yeah. You poor fool! Now you be praying for my experiments! So instead of shooting me dead here, he'll just do this. Also, this music. Oh, he's trying to. What? What is this music? Yo, is this the Rockin fly? Up. Yeah, <laughs> this is exactly the fly. He's, he's gonna be taking some of the enemies we've seen in the stage and combining them. Okay. That that's <laughs> that's this is this is his dark experiments. He's training or he's combining things fly style. Mostly with flies. Mostly apparently. with flies, yes. Do, do, are, are you scared of his dark experiments, Donnie? More like dork experiments. 
This is what he betrayed the, uh, the government for, so he could combine a fly and a flower that now shoots dangerous plasma pollen everywhere. I mean, I guess it's better than what Lex Luthor did with his alien cell. <laughs> How dare you refer to me? <laughs> refer to that movie in my presence? <laughs> I can't believe he just invented a thing that gave you weapons. <laughs> I can't believe he invented a thing that exploded uselessly. <laughs> well, listen, if, is that not the essence of mad science? Inventing things that explode uselessly. I mean, I guess. Oh my god. What? I was gonna say, that fucking... You better watch out for that monster, dude. It's gonna get swole. <laughs> no, this is gonna get swole. Oh, God! How could I have seen this coming? <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> he got at... But no, like, that one fucking monster was just doing push-ups with an entire other monster growing <laughs> out of its ass. <laughs> Oh, and this is why Brownie is a beginner character. Because in order to kill this boss, uh -huh. you need to get under those legs uh -huh. and shoot up at that core. Or you can just have a weapon that shoots through walls. Okay. <laughs> also, he's short, so he doesn't have to worry about, you know, whatever the hell he's shitting out of his yeah. alien mouth. I never imagined that the doctor shitting was looking... out of his mouth. Yes, that's exactly what it was doing. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, God. I never imagined that the doctor was working for the enemy. Man, I gotta say, <laughs> uh -huh. we, uh... We made a lot of progress once I started deciding not to steal your lives. <laughs> join at any time, it's just... <laughs> I, you... I figured, like, I'd be polite and not steal all your lives. <laughs> That's fine, I'm yeah, sure too, but... <sighs> uh, it's like fucking... When I was a kid playing Gauntlet in the friggin' arcade. But like, you know, s some other kid was there, like, friggin' playing the game. And I was just... I I thought it would be funny to play as fucking Pojo the Chicken. <laughs> That chicken was fucking legit, dude. I will not even front you for doing that. Yeah, but I also, like, you know, use their fucking tokens to uh, respawn. Right. <laughs> Felt a little bit bad, yeah. but overall was kind of like... Uh, you know, they, they told me it was okay. Yeah. Bruh, here it's like... We also have to progress, I guess. <laughs> That's why God invented save states, Donnie, okay? That doesn't help us. No, it doesn't. Anyways. <laughs> it's not gonna bring our lives back, D. <laughs> and this game doesn't even have the Konami code built in. They took it out of the American version. Oh my god. The, this, the Japanese version of this game has a life bar. The American version did it. Because they, I guess they really wanted to live up to the hardcore part of Contra Hardcore. I guess. Ugh. Because of that, we now know where their HQ is. We will take an overseas route to strike at them. This time we'll take them out with extreme prejudice. Wow. <laughs> what a bigot. Not even remotely what he meant, and you know. Alright, well, since you got an extra life, I'm going in. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll be fucking Duke Nukem. Okay. Alright, so this guy just. I tried to friggin' press square. Don't, don't shoot, shoot, don't again. shoot. Okay, let, let those go down, and then. Yeah. What? What if I want to shoot them? Watch out, he's gonna shoot. Yeah, there you go. I mean, you can shoot them. It's probably a good idea so you don't bump into them. Yeah, man. And this is all this guy does. He snipes at us and then he shoots, uh... Fuck! Damn it. 
<laughs> See, I wanted to shoot the things that were falling in a way that didn't involve being under them. <laughs> that's that's fair. That's that's true. You, you I don't... just didn't think that I, you know, the fucking plane would drive into me <laughs> while I was jumping. <laughs> what the fuck is this? It's some sort of sea urchin. It's dead. Okay. <laughs> so is our boat. No, it's fine. It sends one of. I don't know what you call these things. Hover bikes? But, see, it's a specific hover bike that allows you to walk on water. Like, you can walk. I don't know how the hell this works, but whatever. Okay. And it's just as fast as the boat that we were using. Yes. So why the fuck weren't we using this the whole time? I... I... I don't know. <laughs> I'm high speed! <laughs> Fuck. No! No! See, I'm gonna cheat and just use this weapon from now on. Is that cheating? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. This weapon is ungodly strong for some reason. I don't know why. Like, I guess they didn't expect players to use it or something, but it, it does a pretty good job of just monstering bosses like that. And the fact that he's got two fucking homing weapons is just like icing on the cake. Cause he's got this, uh -huh. and he's got that. And then he's got a weapon that fucking goes through through enemies, and then he's got this to oh shit, my God. a shit ton of damage. I got <laughs> I I have a feeling because Gunstar Heroes was released around the same time uh -huh. that the team at Konami was just like, oh we could do this too, a robot that fucking combines. Because we want to show off our graphics. That, that's how, that's what they wanted to do here. <laughs> sure. Like, the, the, the entire 90s was nothing but one-upmanship in, in video games like this, you know? <laughs> Only the 90s. Only the 90s, yes. Fuck! I mean, I don't know. I guess it just goes to show. It's, uh, it's never been a new thing with, uh video game companies trying to, you know, borrow ideas from one another. Oh yeah. <laughs> the the Now it's a fucking bird. It is. <laughs> like when you stop and really think about this, it's like who came up with the idea of a robot that transforms into animal? Well first it was a fucking mecha. Now it's a mecha bird. Sure. And now it's... Well... Here's here's the thing, right? Mm -hmm. hmm. Nah, it doesn't add up. It's not one-to-one. -one. Oh, here's something fun. What? You're supposed to stand in the area that it targets. <laughs> that's, that's yeah, that that fucking <laughs> that's some troll shit right there. Like, imagine you playing that for the first time. You're like, oh, a target. I should avoid that. Nope. That's yeah. where you're supposed to be sitting. No. Yeah, that would be me. <laughs> that's exactly what I would do, and I would be upset. Yeah. No, that's completely fair to be upset about that because that's that's cheating. That's how that boss fucks with. Anyway. You. It's yeah. it's a robot made of three parts that has a different configuration for based on what part takes the uh, the the lead. Yeah. The head. Yeah. I'm just saying that's some get a robo shit right there. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. Oh, you got another man. Yeah. Well, you want to take a quick break here, real quick. Sure. Okay.